to the joy of music. My name is Diane Bish, and I would like to invite you to join us today as we make a musical visit to Edinburgh, Scotland, with music from the majestic St. Giles Cathedral, found in the center of Edinburgh. Thank you for joining us. Across George IV Bridge, at the top of High Street, stands the High Church of St. Giles, the only parish church of medieval Edinburgh, and the home of Presbyterianism, where the firebrand preacher John Knox launched the Scottish Reformation. The kirk is called St. Giles Cathedral because Charles I called it so when he introduced bishops into the Church of Scotland and the name remained even after Presbyterianism was reestablished. Today it remains an active and vibrant house of worship for the local congregation and visitors from around the world. A statue of John Knox was cast in 1904, which conveys something of the energy that those who heard him must have felt. Even when he was old and infirmed, he was so active and vigorous that it looked as if he was about to break the pulpit in bits and fly out of it.
windows of St. Giles are masterpieces of art. The painted and stained glass windows seen in St. Giles today were installed from 1883 onwards, and fragments of medieval glass were even found during recent excavation in the cathedral. One of the most beautiful windows shows Jesus stilling the tempest. Music is an integral part of church services in St. Giles. The choir of mixed voices has an extensive repertoire drawn from the European tradition of sacred music over the centuries. Even the gowns, although of recent design, add to the impression of timeless worship.
The organ of St. Giles Cathedral was built by the Rieger Organ Company of Austria and was completed in 1992. The instrument is an outstanding example of the organ builder's art and craft, matched by the powerful statement made by its contemporary organ casework. The specification comprises 4,000 pipes, 58 stops, spread over three manuals and pedals with mechanical action and fully computerized stop control. The great organ and music of St. Giles Cathedral in Edinburgh bring to mind Psalm 150. Oh, praise ye the Lord. Praise him in his sanctuary. Praise him with stringed instruments and organs. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord.
places make such a strong impression on the visitor as Edinburgh. Scotland's capital is without doubt one of the most beautiful and elegant cities in Europe. The views around Edinburgh have to be seen to be believed. Down from the castle across the Georgian Newtown, from the Newtown out across the Firth of Forth, from Arthur's Seat across the surrounding moors, and the most dramatic cityscape in Europe from Carlton Hill down the length of Princess Street to the castle overlooking the city. My name is Diane Bish, and I would like to thank you for joining us today on The Joy of Music as we have brought you a musical visit to Edinburgh, Scotland, with music from the famous St. Giles Cathedral. Thank you for joining us.
would like to purchase today's program or any program in our library of over 400 videos and CDs from the great organs and historic churches of the world, please call 1-800-933-4844. We hope to hear from you.